Hey everyone, welcome to Vitality, the channel dedicated to helping you live a more wholehearted life. Today, we're diving deep into the core of what it means to be human, our emotions. Emotional intelligence, or EQ, isn't about being nice all the time or suppressing how we feel. It's about understanding and navigating the complex world of emotions, both ours and those around us. Whether it's a tough conversation, a high-stakes presentation, or daily life, our ability to connect with our emotions and respond effectively is paramount. So, what exactly is emotional intelligence? It's a framework to understand ourselves better and show up more fully in the world. Think of it as five interconnected pillars, self-awareness, self-regulation, motivation, empathy, and social skills. Self-awareness is about tuning into our emotions and understanding the stories behind them. Self-regulation is about managing our feelings in a healthy way. Motivation connects us to our values and purpose, helping us navigate challenges. Empathy allows us to understand and connect with others' feelings. Social skills help us build meaningful connections and communicate effectively. These pillars work together to enhance our emotional intelligence. By focusing on these areas, we can improve our relationships and overall well-being. Let's explore each pillar in more detail. Identifying and acknowledging our emotions can be tough. For years, many of us have been taught to suppress our feelings, but our emotions hold valuable information. Start by paying attention to physical sensations in your body. Label your emotions specifically. Are you anxious, frustrated, or overwhelmed? Allow yourself to feel the full spectrum of human emotion without judgment. Journaling can be a powerful tool for emotional awareness. Check in with yourself throughout the day and notice any thoughts or beliefs fueling your emotions. Emotional awareness is a lifelong commitment to understanding ourselves better. As we become more attuned to our emotions, we navigate the world more effectively. Embrace this journey inward and discover the power of emotional awareness. In our fast-paced world, where the hustle and bustle of daily life can often feel overwhelming, it's easy to feel like we're on autopilot, moving through our days without truly experiencing them. Mindfulness helps us hit the pause button and bring our attention to the present moment. It allows us to step back from the chaos and find a sense of calm amidst the storm. Meditation is a powerful way to cultivate mindfulness. By setting aside time to meditate, we create a space where we can reconnect with ourselves and the world around us. It's not about emptying our minds but observing our thoughts and feelings without getting swept away. This practice helps us understand our inner landscape better. Start with a few minutes each day focusing on your breath. Notice the sensation of the air entering and leaving your body. This simple act can anchor you in the present moment. Journaling is another tool for self-reflection, allowing us to process emotions and gain clarity. Writing down our thoughts can help us see patterns and understand our feelings more deeply. Mindful breathing can be done anytime, anywhere, grounding us in the present moment. Whether you're in a busy office or a quiet park, taking a few deep breaths can help you reset. As we cultivate mindfulness, we develop greater self-awareness and manage stress better. This heightened awareness allows us to respond to situations with more clarity and calm. Remember, mindfulness is a practice that takes time and patience. It's not about achieving perfection, but about making a commitment to be present. Be kind to yourself and celebrate small victories along the way. Each moment of mindfulness is a step towards a more balanced and peaceful life. Embrace mindfulness to create more joy and peace in your life. By being present, we can fully appreciate the beauty of each moment and find contentment in the here and now. Mindfulness isn't limited to meditation or breathing exercises. It can be integrated into daily activities like cooking, walking, or even washing dishes. By paying attention to the sensations and experiences of these tasks, we can turn ordinary moments into opportunities for mindfulness. Practicing mindfulness in a group can also be beneficial. Sharing the experience with others can provide support and encouragement, making the practice more enjoyable and sustainable. There are many resources available to help you on your mindfulness journey. Apps and guided meditations can provide structure and guidance, especially for beginners. Over time, you'll likely notice changes in how you relate to yourself and others. Mindfulness can lead to greater empathy, compassion, and a deeper understanding of your own needs and desires. By incorporating mindfulness into your daily routine, you can find a better balance between work and personal life. This balance can lead to improved well-being and a more fulfilling life. Gratitude is another aspect of mindfulness. Taking time to appreciate the positive aspects of your life can enhance your overall sense of happiness and contentment. 
Nature can be a wonderful setting for mindfulness practice. Whether you're walking in a forest, sitting by the sea, or simply enjoying a garden, being in nature can help you feel more connected and grounded. Setting intentions for your mindfulness practice can also be helpful. Whether it's to reduce stress, improve focus, or simply to be more present, having a clear intention can guide your practice and keep you motivated. The journey of mindfulness is a personal one, and it's important to honor your own path. Celebrate your progress, be patient with yourself, and remember that every moment of mindfulness is a gift to yourself. Sharing your mindfulness journey with friends or loved ones can also enrich your experience. Discussing your insights and challenges can deepen your understanding and strengthen your relationships. Ultimately, mindfulness is about finding joy in the simple moments of life. Whether it's enjoying a cup of tea, watching a sunset, or spending time with loved ones, being present allows you to fully experience and appreciate these moments. Embrace mindfulness as a way to create a more joyful, peaceful, and fulfilling life. By being present, you can transform your everyday experiences and find deeper meaning and satisfaction in each moment. Understanding our emotions is one thing. Responding to them healthily is another. Cognitive restructuring helps us challenge and reframe negative thought patterns. For example, if you make a mistake at work, challenge the thought, I'm a failure. Positive affirmations can also cultivate a healthier emotional landscape. Statements like, I am worthy, or I am resilient, can transform our self-perception. Our thoughts shape our beliefs and influence our emotions. By challenging negative thoughts and replacing them with positive ones, we create a more fulfilling life. Remember, we can't control what life throws our way, but we can control our responses. Embrace these techniques to develop healthy emotional responses. Transform your relationship with your emotions for a more positive life. Humans are wired for connection, but it's easy to feel disconnected. Cultivating empathy starts with understanding others' feelings. Active listening is key. Focus on what the other person is saying without your own agenda. Perspective taking helps us see the world through someone else's eyes. Ask yourself, what might it be like to be in their position? Empathy builds bridges of understanding and strengthens relationships. Practice empathy in everyday interactions and pay attention to those around you. Small acts of empathy can make a significant difference. Remember, empathy is a skill that takes practice. Embrace empathy to create a more compassionate and connected world. Boundaries protect our physical, emotional, and mental well-being. They're about honoring our needs and setting healthy limits. Identify your non-negotiables and set boundaries that honor them. Communicate boundaries clearly and respectfully using I statements. For example, say, I'm feeling overwhelmed, I need to reschedule. Setting boundaries is an act of self-care, prioritizing our well-being. Stress is a normal part of life, but chronic stress can harm our health. Develop healthy coping mechanisms like exercise to manage stress. Physical activity releases endorphins, boosting our mood. Embrace boundaries and stress management for a healthier life. Expressing emotions, especially vulnerable ones, can be terrifying. Emotions are not good or bad, they simply are. Bottling up emotions can lead to unhealthy manifestations. Learn to express emotions constructively for healthy relationships and well-being. Assertive communication helps express needs and boundaries respectfully. Use I statements to take ownership of your feelings. For example, say, I feel angry when you do that. Expressing emotions is about fostering understanding and connection. If struggling, seek support from a therapist or counselor. Embrace constructive expression for a more authentic life. Life is messy, but we are wired for resilience. Resilience is about feeling the full range of emotions while holding on to hope. Embrace challenges as opportunities for growth. Stepping outside our comfort zones expands our resilience. Cultivate a positive outlook by focusing on the good amidst challenges. Practicing gratitude shifts our perspective positively. Reflect on things you're grateful for daily. Building resilience is a lifelong practice of showing up for ourselves. Embrace resilience to navigate life's inevitable storms. Discover the strength within to overcome adversity. Emotional intelligence is a lifelong journey of self-discovery and growth. It's about embracing the messy, imperfect nature of being human. Commit to continuous learning through books, podcasts, and workshops. 
Seek mentors who embody emotional intelligence and learn from them. Practice makes progress. Put these principles into daily practice. Don't fear mistakes. Each experience is an opportunity for growth. Be kind to yourself and celebrate small victories. Change takes time and progress isn't always linear. Embrace the journey of emotional intelligence for a more fulfilling life. Continue learning and growing to enhance your emotional intelligence. Emotional intelligence is a journey filled with self-discovery and growth. Embrace your emotions as teachers guiding you toward a more authentic life. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to Vitality. Hit the notification bell to stay updated on new content. Let's continue this conversation in the comments below. Share your thoughts and journey with emotional intelligence. Together we can create a world where vulnerability and connection are valued. Live a more vital and meaningful life with the tools we've discussed.